Hey there. Uh, German websites usually have this impress them link and there could be several links like that. And if you click on that, then it opens, in this case, a different tab and it just goes to the press contact information. And apparently it's very common and you want to confirm that this link works using Cypress test. So let's take a look at this model that has impress them. How would we test this? Well, we visit the site and then we can say contains Impressum. And in this case, I don't want to limit ourselves to just exact spelling. I think it would make more sense if we don't match the case. Because then it doesn't matter if it's lowercase or uppercase. One thing that I want to be careful about is which one do we find? Right now, if I hover, notice it actually finds the one in the footer. But I probably want to click the one right here. Why does it find the bottom one? Most of these model dialogues, they're added to the body of a document dynamically. And when you add it to the body, you probably add it at the end of the body element. That's why when we find site contains in Pressum, it finds the first one in the body and not the one added in the model. So in this case, not a big deal. We can look at this model dialog, notice it has an ID, nothing specific here, fine. We can say, okay, in this case, this is a link, but it's inside this element with this ID. Let's see if now we find the right impressor. And now we do find it. Now we can click on this, but it opens a new tab and we want Cypress to continue testing in the same tab. Fine. So how do we do that? This link opens a new tab because this anchor link has the target underscore blank. So let's first confirm it that this attribute should have attribute target underscore blank. And then we want to invoke jQuery method attribute target and replace blank with underscore self. So that will force the URL to open in the same current tab. Perfect. Now, what do we want to validate here? Notice the URL changes to the impressum and a couple of search parameters. Fine. Let's just confirm it. We can say sci location path name should equal slash impressum because we're not interested in the query parameters. We just want to know the path name right here. Perfect. I think our impressum in the pop-up dialog is working just fine. 